Hello, it's Harlas here and welcome back to Sea Encounters Destroyers. So we are still in the main brackets and today we've got Arbold by Korot, which just barely uh, won his last rematch and is now armed with a slightly less potent round than he original had. And on the other side, we've got Fuyukaze by the Thief Guy. So, a nice torpedo boat. Not very fast, not uh, very powerful guns, but it definitely has that, that powerful torpedoes. If they survive, they can uh, really make a lot of difference, I think. So, for now, just some minor clipping, minor damage landed by Arbold. Some... Yeah, just... Uh, okay. Interesting hit here. Straight in the bow. And we are closing in, all right, so we are already at the below the, the minimum distance. The, the final fight circle has, uh, has been reached and now the ships will probably angle a little bit and start their battle dance. Okay, Fuyukaze is opening up its artillery and, and landing some, some minor hits here and there. The, the main, uh, the main uh, weapon uh, that is the that is of course the torpedo launcher is being moved into position and yeah finally the torpedoes are, uh, are launched and yeah they are really really fast and correct there was a very good hit on Arbold but I think it was just shy of doing a critical damage to the boiler. So Arbold was really lucky there that the propulsion is still intact. But another valley is coming in. I think that some of those torpedoes have been damaged so they did not deliver a full, full hit. It's uh, Arbold is definitely winning on points, and the propulsion still intact, but something hit the stern, and yeah, indeed, the rudder is gone, and the propeller on the left side is gone as well. So let's have a look on, on the other side. Torpedo launchers, which are the most important component on this ship are partially disabled, partially destroyed. However, the left side of the of these uh, of these torpedo launchers is still functional, so it should be able to deliver some another volley, I think. It has been quiet for uh, for some time. Not sure if it's firing arc or something got broken there. But torpedoes have not been fired back, which is really bad news. Some flak is being thrown at uh, Ryukaze. And it's just returning fire for, uh, with those uh, small guns. So. So it might be it, actually. I 
despite delivering this uh, these good hits here, partial incapacitation and uh, very close to to getting the boiler fully shut off. But I think it's actually on this side. It is uh, disabled, but I think that there is some alternative boiler and uh, steam pressure is still being delivered to, into the system. So, Arbold is still moving quite well without major problems actually with, with, just, with this just one propeller. And the steering is still there, so not a big problem. I'm not sure what happened to the torpedo launcher. It's placed in a quite similar way as its opponents, just midship. So the firing, angle, firing angles are not great there. But I think the firing angle is not the, the issue here. I think it's um, it just have it just have been disabled by. Uh, by Fuyukaze guns, I think. So they did, did do something. And Fuyukaze is uh, almost done, 66%. Those torpedoes would really come in handy to just uh, seal the deal here. And yeah, flag is doing a lot of noise, but it's not really uh, doing that, man uh, that much damage. Those uh, AP shells, they are doing the majority of uh, destruction. These are quite big, if they are real, these are quite big uh, depth charges, actually. I don't think that uh, actually Fuyukaze uh, got to use them in the challenge battle. It looks like Arbold is uh, have that in the bag, and yeah, it seems like it's going to meet my own ship, so Warsaw actually in the sem semi-finals. Alright, yeah, I think there's uh, no real reason to, to prolong this. I think that uh, everyone can agree that uh, Fuyukaze has totally zero 
fighting capabilities right now and it's just a sitting duck it would be just a matter of time to bring it down and five minutes should be more than enough to do it so let's call it a victory on uh, Arbold's side congratulations and uh, condolences to the thief guy to the Viet guy sorry and uh, yeah Fuyokaze is going to go to the secondary bracket and uh, have some fights there so it can still come back uh, to meet the winner of uh, of Arbold versus uh, Warsaw match. Thank you very much for watching and see you in the next episode.